The next sketch of the night was uh, written and directed by Jordan Pilkington, who Woo! paid me to say it's a true grit about a true romance. <laughs> this is 902 Gun O. Oh, you're gonna break that against me now? 
Not still young, I got my six piece right here. Oh yeah? What about true love, hmm? God damn bastard coming up. True love and fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you forgetting something? Tara. Well. Go to sleep. <laughs> Dogs got paws. <laughs> Go to sleep, just don't pee. All right, good night, little buddy. <laughs> Chase me. <laughs> yep. What was that picture you looked at today with that? It's a reminder of what it used to have. It's too hard to talk about. You know, no, 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 no. <laughs> Me and the missus, we, uh, we had a ranch once. Nothing too grand like what you and yours got, but enough to keep us happy. Well, I, I've been mean my whole life. And what I'm trying to say is she knew about all the thieving and the outlaw, and, and she was okay with that. And I knew from the beginning I wasn't no good for her. Any blind man could have told you that, but she loved me. I loved her. Till one day the thieving and the outlaw got to be too much, even for her. She, uh, I, I should have stopped for her. I should have, but I couldn't stop doing what I've done been doing since, since day one. Eventually she realized what we all been doing. Packed up her things and gotten the hell out of the dodge that is my life. Oh, Skip. I'm so sorry. Did you keep the picture to remind you of her and remind you never to let the dark side of yourself get between you and the relationships you build? What? Hell no, I keep remind myself to get, get a better divorce lawyer next time. Wait, what? <laughs> I took half of everything we own. Fair, but you don't have the one cap. How we sorted that one out? I really got it right. There was blood everywhere. I will never forget the sound. Jesus, man. Oh, poor Betsy Woo Woo. <laughs> <laughs> so, what was the name of that girl you were talking about? Her name's Elizabeth, and she's the sunshine of my wagon. Her smile is like a, like a summer's mood, and her life is like a. It's like a. Well, uh, it's like a. If the sun's moon could make a noise. <laughs> so yeah. yeah. How'd you meet her? She used to live on a ranch about a mile from my home. I'd sneak down at night and listen to her say. Oh wait. Uh, you ever talk to her? Uh yeah, of course I did. So I am not riding 20 days round trip so you can introduce yourself to some girl you ain't never conversated with. She knows me. You'll see. Oh, I swear I'll still shoot you if this is some malarkey. Uh -huh. Sure you will. <laughs> Don't you all oh, for me? How'd you end up in the middle of nowhere, Oklahoma? Uh, family obligations. It's been damn near ten years since the last saw her. Well, I hope she's worth all this. Hey, Smith. Thanks for riding with me 20 years round trip on this, friend. It's been my pleasure, friend. We're almost there. It's right over this here grassy hill. Wasn't we just in a desert? Oh, hush now. We're here. <laughs> Elizabeth, just 
Come back to Texas with me. Why do you move up here to a silly old home anyways? Because I got married? You were at the oh. wedding. <laughs> I didn't think it was a real deal. <laughs> Anywhere, so one could assume that he took He's off. He's right here in the field. He waved at me when he got here. <laughs> Get the prenup. <laughs> <laughs> 